There is some movement, and I don't want to, I don't want to, well, maybe choose my words. There's some movement, there's been a response from the opposition, but, um, it, it, yes, I'm sorry, from Hamas, but it seems to be uh, a little over the top. We're not sure where it is. There's a continuing negotiation right now. We're going to secure the border and fund these other programs. Right, right, right after I was elected, I went to a, what they call a G7 meeting, all the NATO leaders. I was in, I was in the south of England, and I sat down and I said, "America's back." And Mitterrand from Germany, I mean from France, looked at me and said, uh, "said, you know." What? Why? How, how long are you back for? And I looked at him, and the, and the Chancellor of Germany said, what would you say, Mr. President, if you picked up the paper tomorrow in the London Times, and the London Times said, a thousand people break through the House of Commons, break down the doors, two bobbies are killed in order to stop the election of the Prime Minister, what would you say? I never thought about it from that perspective. What would we say if that happened in another democracy around the world?